Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing amazing today. So in this video, we're gonna be doing a 17 minute stretching routine to help you get your splits. So this video is part of my 28 day get your splits challenge, which is right here on my website. And since this challenge is free, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications. So for this stretching routine, we're gonna need a couple of things. So you're gonna need your blocks or books like I have over here. Ideally that they're the same height. Also, you're gonna need a band. So here I'm using my booty band as a resistance band. If you cannot touch your toes, sometimes this can help you a lot to improve that flexibility. I'm gonna leave you guys the link down below and you can use the discount code 28 day to stretch to get 28% off your booty band. So this is going to be limited for the month of February. Don't forget to use my hashtag Daniela Suarez challenge for any challenge that you're doing because every single month we are selecting a winner that is very dedicated and that is sharing their journey with us. So we're gonna be sending you a mystery box with makeup products, booty bands, active wear, and many other things that you are going to enjoy and it's gonna keep you motivated. We're we're also using a calendar which you can share with us on Instagram. You can use it as your accountability measure. So this calendar is going to be available on my website which is also linked right here. All right, so without further ado, let's get started. We are starting with high lunge on the left so here you want to lift your back knee try to form a straight line with your body Next is low lunge on elbows, so try to go on your elbows in this pose and if that's too much you can always stay on your hands or on the blocks as shown in the variation. Next is side lunge on your left foot, so here you want to keep that knee straight and try to touch the floor. You can always help yourself with the wall or a chair to keep balance. Next is high lunge on the other side, so here remember to try to form a straight line with your body. You can use the blocks if you need to. Next is low lunge, so let's place our knee on the floor. Try to go on your elbows or stay on your hands or on the blocks.
side lunge on the other side so here try to keep that leg straight going out and try to go as deep as you can in this half squat Next is the frog pose, so in this pose you are trying to keep the hips aligned to your knees so just let gravity do its thing here and relax. Next is half middle splits, so the left leg goes out straight and relax. Next is half middle splits on the other side, so here right leg straightens and try to just relax in this pose. Next we're sitting down in front of the wall, trying to do the middle splits as close as we can and keeping our back straight. Next we're lying down on our backs and we're going to let gravity do its thing so just relax and try to loosen up here. Next is deep squat, so in this case you can use a chair or the wall to help you out and try to keep your feet parallel to each other and go as deep as you can in the squat. Next we're lying down and hugging our left knee, just keeping it really hugged, relax and stay there.
next we are straightening that leg and trying to bring it close to our body as much as we can flexing that foot Next, we are bringing that leg towards the side as straight as possible. So try to keep that leg straight. If you can't do this, you can always grab your ankle or your leg and you can keep your knee bent. We are switching sides here and hugging the right knee as much as we can. Keep that back in the mat. Next, we are straightening that leg and trying to touch our foot or our leg, bringing it closer to our body, keeping the back in the mat. Next, we are opening up one more time to create some space in your hips. Bring it to the side and just let gravity do its thing. Now we're going into forward fold, so you're going to sit down, keep your back straight as much as you can and relax towards the front. Try to grab your ankles so you can pull yourself into your legs and feel it in the hamstrings. Next is quad stretch, so in this pose we are starting by going on our hands and then trying to go on our elbows and then if you can just completely lie down, feel the stretch in your quads. Next, we are lying down on our backs, grabbing our left leg and trying to bring that leg as straight as possible and as close as possible to our body. If it's bent, your knee, that's okay. It's a great start. Just try to keep that leg straight as much as you can.
we're switching legs so here you grab your right leg try to keep it as straight as you can and take a big deep breath so that you can bring that leg closer to your body Next, we are trying the middle splits. So here, try to go as slow as you can. Use the blocks if you need to. And here, it's all about letting gravity do its thing. So if it is uncomfortable, that's perfect. Stay there as long as you can. Next, we are practicing the splits on the left, so it's okay if you don't have it yet. This is why we do this. We are practicing and just trust the process that you will get to your goal and let gravity do its thing. We are switching sides and here one more time, relax, let it happen, use the blocks if you need to, close your eyes and just stay there as long as you can.